I want to thank Michael for leaving such nice comments in the uh, se comment section of my YouTube videos. I just want to acknowledge that because I'm very appreciative of the positivity you guys give me and it really keeps me going. Uh, today I want to talk about the Gold Money shareholder letter. Uh, Gold Money and Monet are as connected as any two companies could be. In fact, Monet came from Gold Money. It's the same CEO founder. Uh, Gold Money owns like 57% of Monet. Uh, that's like 93 million shares. And uh, Monet buys all its gold from Gold Money for the jewelry. Uh, the shareholder letter today for Gold Money, there's a section called Gold's Greatest Virtue. And it's written by the founder CEO of both companies. His name is Roy Sabog, and I think he's the most uh, brilliant thinker on gold in modern times. Uh, almost everything I've learned about gold comes from Roy. Uh, he says a lot in this letter. It's just way too much for me to encapsulate into a two minute video. But uh, to boil it down, uh, if I can do that, he says in one sentence, um, to reject gold is to reject nature. And that's one of the things that I learned from Roy is he taught that um, gold ascended as money through civilizations throughout time, not because of a uh, government t decree, like uh, something like fiat, but because of its natural uh, properties and because of its, um, and, you, know, you know, the nature of gold, how it uh, could be produced once and then it uh, lasts forever. And so you can store it for um, very little cost and there will never be any decay. Uh, and you can do that with your uh, 24 karat mini jewelry and you can actually wear it and um, uh, enjoy it and have all the, the benefits of having a, a sentimental piece of jewelry. But um, I recommend that everybody read this letter to get a great understanding of gold. And if you want to know some of Roy's thinking behind gold and some of the uh, brilliant thoughts of the person who created Monet and created gold money. I recommend that you read that letter and he's not as, as active on social media anymore, which I love because that just means that he's that much more focused on building the companies, which I think provides more value to people than, um, you know, some of the noise that social media has. Uh, and so reading this letter, it's a very, um, it's a very rare, uh, insight into his mind because you don't hear from him as often. So read the letter and let me know your thoughts on, um, the gold's greatest virtue.